Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. In today's video, I'm going to be showing you how to do this DIY. And the DIY we're going to be working on is an alcohol bouquet. So let's get started. What we're going to be needing is ribbon, the kind that curls, a vase, pipe cleaners, tape, foam, tissue paper, some kind of filler paper to put inside the vase, skewers, and like a flower stem cutter, and of course your miniature alcohol bottles. So the first thing that we're going to be doing is cutting the ribbon and then wrapping that around the neck of the bottle and then we're going to take the sharp end of our scissors and we're going to curl it. So make sure you get the ribbon that curls and this is really nice because you can customize the color of the ribbon. Over here I used white but you can get it in hundreds of different kinds of colors and it just it's really nice to customize your own arrangement the way that you want to. So we're going to go ahead and put that on every single bottle that we got and curl it. And then over here what I'm doing is putting super glue on the back of the bottle and then I'm going to stick the skewer on. But it wasn't really sticking so I put tape over it so that the glue sticks onto the bottle with the skewer as well as like it's held on by the tape. So go ahead and do that to all of your bottles and then we're going to go on to the next step. So over here I'm cutting the stem and I'm kind of just eyeballing it, measuring it um, as I go. And I'm dropping all the cuts, cut pieces into the jar just so it's easier for me to just clean it up, just pick it up and throw all the pieces away. And then I'm going to stuff it with my filler stuff <laughs> and I'm gonna cut a piece of tissue paper right here and I'm gonna wrap my foam around it just so you don't see that ugly green color and I'm gonna stick that in there and then over that I'm gonna be putting more filler so the red doesn't show because I don't want the red to show is if you do want it to show that's up to you but for this arrangement I kind of just wanted it all shiny pink and silver and just cut the edges off so they're not like sticking out and then here what I'm doing is just arranging it the way that I want it to go in the vase so so I have like two rows and then the bottom row cut the skewers a little bit shorter so they don't stick out as much and then here I'm gonna be taking little pieces of tissue paper and cutting the edges round and then turning those sideways and stick the skewer in so they're kind of like the petals of the bottle if you get what I'm saying and then we're going to do that to all the pieces of tissue paper it doesn't have to be perfect and stick the skewer in and then go ahead and stick that right into your vase and this is our first row of the alcohol and then I'm going to be cutting more tissue right here and sticking the longer pieces into the back and it's a lot easier when you have it arranged on the floor just so you know where everything goes and um, how you want it to look in the end. So here I'm going to be sticking this in the back in a diagonal way. And then you'll see how it looks. The next one I'm going to be doing the same thing and then turning my vase backwards and sticking it in a diagonal way. So these two that I just did should be crossing each other in the back. And that's how you know they're more steady and they won't budge. And then this one I'm going to be sticking diagonal as well. But I'm going to be doing it in the middle of these two right here. And then I'm going to be sticking this one in the middle of the other two. So basically we are all done with sticking the bottles in. Now we're going to take our pipe cleaners and wrap that around our finger and then pop that off and then the tip of it you kind of just adjust it how long you want it and how tight you want the curl to be so I'm going to be doing that to a couple of different pipe cleaners this is also pretty neat because you can customize the pipe cleaners to whatever color you want you can have them shiny or you could have the more velvety ones and then I'm going to take little pieces of skewers and I'm going to wrap the pipe cleaners around the skewer so it's easier for me to stick in and so that it sticks out more. And I really, really love the way that it turned out. When you stick the skewers in, it just adds a whole different new look to it. It's so cute. 
and then I'm going to be doing that to the rest of my skewers. This is completely optional. You can put um, skewers in here. You could put flowers in here. You can totally be creative and add your own personal touch in here. But I wanted to do the skewers because I wanted it to be a little bit shiny. And then I'm going to stick that in the back. Make sure the ones that you stick in the back, you make the skewers a little bit longer so you don't have to really stick your hand inside the arrangement and, you know, move things around. And then I did some pink ones too, and I stuck that one on both sides. And then after that, you kind of just um, see what else you need, and I'm going to stick more in that I feel like I need to fill the spaces if there's like empty spaces and basically just do your finishing touches and that's it and you can see I also added a ribbon a purple ribbon with polka dots and then I also here's another trick uh, add tissue paper to the sides to make it more sturdy so that's what I did and I hope you guys enjoyed let me know if you guys like this idea and if you guys want to see more DIYs and make sure to hashtag this if you do do it on Instagram with the hashtag Mon see monsters 3 I'll leave the link down below. And I hope you guys enjoyed. Thank you guys so much for watching. I will talk to you guys in my next video. Bye.